trying to get him. He's coming back. Oh! Yeah, I'm fine. Come on, come on, come on. We're getting attacked by bats, babe. Oh, man, come on, Brandon. We got to go in the house, yo. We got to go. What's up, Beverly Hall family? How you guys doing today? Welcome back to the channel, guys. Y'all already know today it's going down in a major way. If you guys haven't, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the post notification bell. Comment down below, early gang, 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 gang. If you guys want to be a part of our early gang, Post notification squad. Wow. So Beverly Hall family, today we have an amazing challenge for you, which is last to leave the pool wins. What did you win? I'm going to win $1,000. $1,000. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. Oh, <laughs> that's that's so I'm going to win. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. All right, so are you guys ready for the rules? Yes. Once you get inside of the pool, you cannot get outside of the pool. Oh, man, that's easy. I see a smile on your face. Is there a reason why you're smiling? I have $8. I have to get $1,000. What you heard on your teeth? You can keep the $8. I want that $1,000. What's in the world? You're not going to win this. No, I am. Yeah. Come on, stop. Oh, y'all fall. And the other, daddy's going to lose his mind during this challenge. There is going to be a process of elimination in case if nobody wants to get out. The winner gets the thousand dollars. You're going to be the loser. Last, I'm not going to lose. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not going to lose. Team girl around here. I'm the queen of the palace and that's exactly how it goes and I win everything every time. So that's how it's going to work. But anyways, the last rule is this. If you get eliminated from the challenge because you lose the challenge, you automatically have to get out of the pool. Okay? That's fair. That's fair. Are you ready, Cannon? Yes, I am. So we the first challenge, are you guys ready for the first challenge? Yes. yes. Biggest splash. Whoever can make the biggest splash gets a freebie save life. Okay. That's okay? Good. I think I'm gonna get the biggest splash because I'm the biggest. You're the biggest? Since when does he think he's the biggest? I'm definitely, look at it. I'm so tall. I'm taller than you, you, and him combined. You're not taller than nobody. Yes, I am. You're not. <laughs> I think he might be right. Do you think you're gonna be able to make the biggest splash? I'm too little. I can't make the biggest splash. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be hard because I don't wanna drown. I'm gonna have the biggest splash because I got the biggest muscles. You know what? I don't think that's gonna work for you today. Really I'm obviously gonna have the biggest splash because I'm like a little tank. You might have the biggest splash because them earrings weighing you down. We oh, might I'm have to pull these you out. about I'm the take pool. These out. And then you're gonna find me in the bottom like, yeah. say, my diamond earring. Oh my God. Ah, there's bees everywhere. Oh my God. Uh, all right, Braylon. Let's see what you got. Do you have a nosebleed? I don't know. Yeah, you do. What happened? Did you hit your face? Oh, he can't do it. Really, all family, this challenge is taking so long. This one's nose is bleeding. This one's. Oh my God. I'm going to be in here for the rest of the day. You need to get that blood off your nose. I slept the wrong way the other night. I can't really jump. I just really don't want to re injure or re injure this little pinched nerve that I have. But wifey is getting mad. Uh, I'm eliminated. Okay, I'm eliminated. I'll be eliminated. Let's see your splash. Are you ready? Yes. 
or we're not gonna have anyone in here after the next one. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be the judge of who gets the thousand dollars, okay? Okay, I will. And then gotta move. He's trying to make me eliminate a Beverly Hall family. You need to tell him he's losing. Come now. on, Cannon, quit We're cheating. Being a cheater. He's trying Cannon to cheat. is cheating. Stop! Or I'm gonna give you a super mega splash in the face. <laughs> Come on, let's do it. Yes, I do. Okay, right. let's see. <laughs> How Hold on, let's, let's see what type of pose you do up underneath. Let's see our Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Okay. Let's go. That was cool. We're trying to get him. We're trying to get him. <laughs> All right. Just because you're cute, I don't know if I'm on your team or not at this point. I'm helping him out a little too much. Yeah, you All gotta right. help him out. Okay. So you're gonna hold your nose like this and do a pose for the camera underneath, like this or something funny. Cool one for you. I'm going all the way to the bottom, okay? You're going all the way to the bottom, huh? Oh, shoot! That's a big boy! Yes, yeah, it's big. big. Boy. God, there's so many bugs out here. Okay. There's a fat out here now. Okay, it's almost yeah. time to go. Yeah, look at that oh bat flying. Ah. Oh, it's bats! It's they bats! You better go. You better hurry up. They bite. Whoa! Did you see that? Yeah, I got it. On the floor, right? Yeah, that was that great. Was cool. <laughs> yeah, but you have to like take all the breath out of your lungs to sink like that. It's really hard. All you right. ain't Michael Phelps. <laughs> around here. Ooh, smell hey. blood. Hold up, hold up. He's right. coming back. He's coming back. Oh! oh. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. Bye. Oh, man. I'm out of here. Bye. Okay. Okay. We're out. done. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Kevin, over here. Oh. Kevin, over here now. Y'all complain. Oh, my God. Get over here, that bat. Yes, over here now. Where's B? Under the water. Oh my god, there's more than one. Yes, there's more than there's one. There's more than one. Riley, get out. Come on, the bats are going to get you. Come on. Look at them flying. They're close. There's bats. We're getting attacked by bats. We're getting attacked by bats, babe. Over here. Come on, Riley. We got to go in the house, yo. We got to go. We got to go. Come on, get in the house. Get in the house. Get in the house. Hurry up. Shut the door before the bats come. No, look, there's like five of them out there now. Oh my god. We can't. Oh, I'm right in the pool. Did you see people in the pool? Yeah, you see them? Just... Oh my god. Why do they like water? I 
don't know. That is so creepy. We literally all lost. The Everybody bats lost. The, pool. The, bats the bats won. It's literally dipping in the pool. The bat oh my hits. god, look at Cannon. Well, Them bats almost took your braids off. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, that's the only thing about this new house. There's lots of animals here. Like lots. Yes. There's sheep. There's probably aliens somewhere. Last night, Mark and I thought we heard a freaking UFO landing in the back yes. of us. You want to know what, guys? I know what happened. The other day, me and Brandon was cleaning the pool, and we seen little baby dead bats inside of the pool. Maybe they're coming to look for their pet, their oh babies. Oh, my God. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. Yeah. Remember, Braylon? Y'all found a dead bat in we there? We found Three. little baby dead Three? ones. Yeah. Little dead ones in the pool. Dead. Yeah. Guys, my kneecaps are literally frozen. Yeah, Braylon's kneecaps are, like, shaking like a tambourine, dude. Boy, you look like a little... Chicken out there. <laughs> I think they was coming for you. They smell chicken meat. Look at them legs. Man, they out here circling like crazy. They are circling. This is their freaking hour. Is our house haunted? Don't go there. I think we got a haunted house, y'all. Anyways, we left the laptop outside. I'm not going to get it. No, you have to go get it. Cause you well, didn't, I gotta go get cause it. Cause you didn't get in the pool. I got a broken back. Okay, oh well. My back is broke. Yeah. You can go out there with the broken back. Man, that get computer it. is gonna stay out there and it's gonna live with the bats. They're gonna be out there typing and getting No, your we need it so I can edit this video. <laughs> no, they're gonna get them emails. And I'm not going out there with them bats, bro. Go. Let's send Mark Cannon out there. Mark Cannon, I'm gone. Mark Cannon. Ooh. If it gets in his hair, though, Marco. No, Cannon, you can't go. Daddy gotta go. You a little brave, dude. Give me some. Because Chicken Braylon ain't gonna go out there and get it. <laughs> what are you talking about? All right, go out there and get the thing, then. Go get it. Beverly Hall fam, you're gonna have to like and subscribe after this because this is too easy. <laughs> if the bat attacks Braylon, I'm gonna feel so bad. <laughs> oh, my God. You win the game. because it is super duper hot. I have water bottles to put the water in. And you already know during the summer you get a lot of germs outside. So you have to have your sanitizer. So this, guys, is for all of their sun care out here. I feel like an outdoor box is the number one summer hack so you don't have to run inside, outside, inside, outside. Little boo-boo darts or whatever for like babies. I don't really use these things. What are these? Okay, but if I throw this in that pool over there and ask you to get it from the bottom, can you do that? Yes. Okay. What are you talking about? That, that's pro. what that's for. Oh. Have like these other water guns, you know we're gonna have to. A so pool noodle gun. This and then it can it can also like float. Oh, Braylon! Why'd you do that? Sorry, but like look, it's a pool noodle. So it can float, so you know we're reaching underwater. Like W Charisma in the chat. Braylon, I'm Let's literally go. about to W Charisma you in no, the pool. No, 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 no. Yeah. Kaden, are you ready to finish these summer hacks? Bruh. Okay, for our next summer hack, you're gonna need some sunscreen and a makeup brush. Because if your baby is anything like mine, he hates whenever I touch his face. So what we're gonna do instead is take a little bit of sunscreen, put it on top of a makeup brush. Oh, that's kind of a lot. See if he'll let me touch his face with it. Okay, let me touch your face. Oh, is it working? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. This hack isn't working on my baby. Maybe he's broken. I turned him into the abominable snowman. Kaden, what she done did to you? She done hacked you all up. Bro. Oh, I feel so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Kaden. Okay, guys, I promise you, I thought that this was gonna work, but I don't know. He, I just don't think my baby likes his face touch. Next hack. Okay, so for this next summer hack, basically, if you know anything about whenever the concrete is on the sun for a little bit too long, your feet will burn. So yeah. this is supposed to make it so that your feet don't burn. So you grab a pool noodle like this, you're gonna cut it like this. 
Oh my gosh, that's kind of hard to get through. Okay, and then we're gonna cut another one the same length like this. This would be low-key cool if they actually work. You're gonna cut six of these. Oh, you're gonna take these three. Now what? You gotta tape his foot down to it. <laughs> you're making like, oh, that's cool. The whole point of the hack is to make sure that your feet don't burn. And this low-key feels comfortable. It actually feels like Crocs. I don't know what type of weird hacks this is, but it looked like she's creating shoes. Uh, what in a rigor, rigor this is. She's not gonna be able to make anything happen if somebody's feet can't fit. Beverly Hills family, who do you think is better, Marcos or mine? Put your foot on him. Ow! I stepped on it. Do you see this? Nice. Oh my gosh, that's so much better. It's like a little baby cactus. It just went through yeah. my whole foot. All right. Here we go. Oh, All right, Braylon. Tell them out. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna take the other one out. Let's see if you can go on there and do your feet burn or not. Go. Go. It still works. I don't feel any hotness on my feet. I feel like you got duck feet. Yeah, you got I duck can stand here all day. You can literally float. No, you can't float. No, you can't float. Hack success. For the next hack, this is a sprinkler. Oh, but would you believe me if I told you that this was a sprinkler too? What? Yeah. That sounds literally impossible. How is that gonna work? It's not impossible. Let me show you how. Take this end of the hose, put it into here. What? Then, that's a lame water gun. It doesn't even get no speed. I don't know. Oh! All right, so we decided we're gonna make one really big sprinkler. Let's see if we can make the biggest homemade sprinkler in the world. We gotta just make sure this is nice and tight. You gotta make sure that it's airtight. So, so you think you're a mechanic? Yes, I know everything. I am dead cool. <laughs> Cannon, that's not nice. You shouldn't be beating your brother. He's trying to help your dad. Bye. Whoa. Are you doing them too close to each other? No. Oh. Make sure you don't poke through to the other side. This is DIY. So you gotta put the holes through here in order for the water goes through. Yes. Like those holes. You're a little, a little menace. Oh, give me that, give me that, give me that. Oh, oh, give me that, give me, give me that. I feel like this is the best life hack, especially for how hot it is. It's uh, still hot even in dawn, guys. Like, I know. that's crazy. It's like 120 degrees still. What? We are Last all guess is, secure. is this fake or real? Let's go, it's real. Is this fake or real? I think it's real. Is this fake or real? Let's go. I think it's real. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my gosh. I thought I had enough pressure though. I wish I had more pressure to up. This summer hack was a Success! Let's go Let's to the next go. one. For this next hack, we have a chocolate bar here. Sorry, Mr. Beast, I love you, but Hershey's is always gonna have my heart. I'm gonna stick this on a plate and we're gonna take this outside. It's supposed to melt and turn into a beautiful creamy fondue. Let's go. I can already feel the heat on my back right now. This has to be the hottest spot of our house. Man, it's about 110 degrees outside. So that's your- should... It's gonna take long at all. Yeah. Do you guys see the sun? Wow, it's Be beaming out, out here. Oh, oh, no. You oh. are right. Stay right there by the door. Stay on the inside, Ken. It's too hot. Oh, yes, that feels better. I feel oh. like this hack right here is probably 100% theoretically correct. We're gonna sit this out there for... I don't know. I feel like it's already melting, don't you? Look at the edges. Okay, okay winner gets what? Winner? I say five minutes. Winner gets the first taste. I say... Okay. I say four minutes. All right, while we're waiting for our chocolate to melt, I have another hack that says that if you take any juice box like this mm -hmm. and you cut off their tops, you can actually stick in popsicle sticks and they will become popsicles for the Whoa. summer. So they say you can karate chop it, but in my experience, these juice boxes are really full. So you're gonna cut into some juice and it's gonna get everywhere. This is a really messy, like look at that. Look how messy that is. The other hack was that instead, if you uh, don't have popsicle sticks to use, that you can use oh, stick silverware. That's the silverware for the popsicles. Yes. Are you, are you gonna put it in the freezer? I'm gonna put it in the freezer. I think it worked. These have been in here for about 18 hours and look, they're almost completely frozen. Don't feel like they're gonna pull out of there. Can you pull it out? How are you gonna get that out if it's stuck in there? Uh, Do you gotta cut the I sides think, of the box? I definitely Oh, no. You got it. it. Watch your finger. Kids, don't well, try this at home. Don't touch knife, knives or, or anything sharp. No sharp objects, kids. Yes. Popsicle. Ooh, that's a thick boy. <laughs> that thing look good. Try it. Mm. What do you rate that? Good. It's good, Kenny. I can smell it already. How that taste, Kenny? Oh. Wait, why does that taste like a popsicle, but better? Wow. 
Really got to sniff it. You got to sniff it. Oh my goodness. This is amazing and it's cold. It's Hold up, guys. Hold up. Let's go check on the chocolate. Anyone remember what, what time? I feel like it hasn't even been five. Oh my god. Ooh, it's and goozy. Who wants to go first? <laughs> me, 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 me. Okay, here. Go ahead, Braylon. Let's go. I want to try the chocolate one. Okay. You know, natural. Wow. Oh. Look at that, guys. Mmm. Is that good? Wow, that was amazing. Okay. Oh my god, you took first. your soul out. I want to try first. Here, Cannon. Wow. Oh, he did a double swirl. You see that? He got a little bit of both. I'm just gonna sip it. Gotta bite the strawberry way, dude. Oh, he ate the stem. You ate everything, dude. Right. I never thought that we would be eating chocolate on the sidewalk. I know, right? This is crazy. Oh, that's your favorite one. Oh my oh, gosh, that crazy. looks so... Oh, what? I just mm. know that just tastes amazing. I really only like white chocolate. So I'm gonna just do white chocolate. Oh, I see how you coming. Put it in. Eat it. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Hack is a success. success. So you know kids love to eat pizza all summer long on summer break. <laughs> Even though I know mine do, they love pizza definitely this one. <laughs> so does. I have a hack just to save some pizza. A pizza hack? Later. All right, let's see. What do you do? What is the hack? So this is the hack, guys. Oh. I wonder what it really is. That looks like a slur. Kaden is kidding me. That's what you get. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Who's eating that baby piece? That baby piece is for Kaden. Oh. But I'm making it more reasonable for everyone, guys. Marco, it looks like you're making baby food. No, I'm not. The pizza is going to go actually back evenly. I'm so nervous. What are you doing? You're ruining our pizza. I'm not ruining it. You are. Everyone's going to still have the same amount of pizza. Don't worry. Oh. Marco, I'm so nervous. I don't, don't think he knows nervous. what he's doing. Guys, he, he probably just ruined our dinner. No, I did not. What is that? Oh, I did not ruin it. He's trying to cut pieces for us. I did not ruin it, guys. Oh, you wait, see this? No, wait, you're trying Look to... at this. Look, watch it go right back evenly, y'all, after I do it. Oh, oh. This is actually a summer hack? A pizza hack. Now you see. It goes right back. Oh, what? Wait, who gets those pizzas? Like a pizza. How did you do that? Yeah. Look at that. Right back like a pizza. I'm Everybody so still lost. Gets the same amount oh. of pizza. So I cut the calories in half, you dig? I cut the calories in half. We didn't ask for that. I cut the calories. <laughs> this is some of the summer hacks that you can try with your family and friends for this whole summer. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Today we're transforming our backyard oh my gosh. into the most epic 14th birthday party for our son Braylon. Are you ready for your birthday party today? Yeah. The problem is Braylon's homeschooled and he doesn't really have many friends. Mom, I don't have any friends. So he's afraid that nobody's going to show up to his party. But here's the thing. Even if no one shows up to his party, Marco and I have a huge surprise gift for him. And we have a special guest in route that will shock him. This was put together very like last minute and I'm really freaking out. But like I have faith in it. Everything is going to work out. The first step is getting this bounce house to fit in our backyard. <gasps> I'm so excited. I'm still very much limping. Oh my God. Oh, I have to make sure that everything goes perfectly. I really wanted this water slide to be able to extend into the pool, but the way our house is built, there's not enough room because it's 20 feet tall. I just ran into a huge problem. I forgot about tables and chairs for our guests. Because I don't know where our guests are gonna sit. Second, I don't even know how to get guests because I invited everyone like literally 12 hours before the party starts. Like, I don't even know if people are gonna show up. I have to go to Target. I probably should not be doing this, but I am not gonna let my baby not have a good birthday party because I freaking twisted my ankle. Moms, if you know, you know, you pull it together. What do you think about how your party's coming together, huh? I know, it looks good. That's huge, but. But mom, I don't have any friends. I told you to tell your friends and you wouldn't tell them. I only have one, like. It's all right. We're gonna have a great birthday party regardless. Aren't you gonna help Braylon have a great day today even if nobody shows up to the party? Yeah. What do you think? That's huge. 
With only four hours left until Braylon's party, we're headed into Target to get some gift bags and hopefully we can find some seating for his potential guests. I'm looking for some goodie bags for your guests. What guests? <laughs> some goodie bags. What about the ones with the polka dots? <laughs> okay, I take that as a no. Maybe I should get these kiddish little baby sharks. No, Braylon, stop being sarcastic. Blue's your favorite color. What about blue? If you can't tell, Braylon is not enthused about the idea of having a party. She put these are just little trinkets. Is this weird to give to kids or is it kinetic sand? Is it fun? I mean to toddlers, yes. Okay, we'll take out what you think is boring. This is boring. This is boring. <laughs> I mean I could go on and on. Those? Maybe just put like one in each. Okay, so now let's add candy and some and some gift cards, right? Yeah. You need twelve. That's Dude, only seven, me. bro. What? What? Oh my god. Dude, your guests are gonna think you're trying to poison them. One, two, three. You got the plastic. Four. This one is not okay. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yep. Here we go. Everybody loves Tootsie Rolls. You're like obsessed with basketball. Okay. Braylon was told at the beginning of this year that he would never be able to play basketball professionally. And what he doesn't know is that Marco and I have something really special up our sleeve at the end of this video. Oh, wow, first try. <laughs> but I wanted to get to the uh, task here. But you do know that you're not allowed to play basketball, like professionally, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. No, seriously. I know yeah, you want know. to, but you literally can't, unless if they find a cure. I mean, I could. If I wanted to. No, Braylon, literally to. you can't. Like, it can literally hurt you really bad. One thing Braylon hates being told is that he can't do something. So where are those gift cards at? Can we get 12 of these? I think eight is good because not all the kids play it. Yeah. One other big problem that I forgot to mention to you is that there's nowhere for your guests to sit and eat their food. Exactly. Oh, and those are huge, like NBA chairs. Wait, what am I saying? WWE chairs. Three. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it. <laughs> two, three, four, five. So we ended up getting 10 chairs and two tables. Hopefully this is enough for whoever shows up and they're able to sit comfortably. Oh my gosh, Braylon, we gotta hurry up because we only have a few hours left for your party. I promise, today's gonna be so worth it, okay? Yeah, but tomorrow's gonna be school. <laughs> Don't think about tomorrow, live in the moment. While Marco's back home making sure that everything's being set up correctly for the party, Braylon and I have to secure a birthday cake. Breed's Bakery came through. You might wanna hold that on your lap. Here, I will, oh God. Oh, we don't have any ice cream. Throwing a birthday party is so much work. Yeah, I, I didn't think that a birthday party would be this special. And you know, like, because I just feel like, why would you need a, a birthday party? Who, who deserves it every single year? Like who, who? I don't you, get it. You're our kid, and we love yeah, you, I and we it. think you're special, and that you deserve to be celebrated, because 14 is a huge milestone. Now that we have everything we need for the party, my husband's gonna leave to go pick up Braylon's special gift. Okay. But on top of the gift, I feel like gifts are one thing, but to actually surprise your kid with something that like no amount of money could ever buy or replace from you is another. So as you guys know, Braylon doesn't have that many friends. When Marco and I got married, Braylon moved all the way across the country with us, and kind of lost all of his friends, all of his family, and everybody. Like, it was a complete fresh and brand new start. And Mark and I did it in good reason because we wanted to give him the best life that we possibly could. But it did, like, take him away from some people, like, and some family that he absolutely loves and adores. So, in particular, he has one best friend that he plays on the game with, and it's his cousin, and he has not seen him in ages. And so, what nobody knows, except for me, I want to make sure no one can hear because this is the biggest surprise. I'm gonna be surprising Braylon with him coming to the party. So this is gonna make the day so much more special. Words cannot put into meaning how much this is gonna to mean to him. So I'm so excited. I just got confirmation that more kids are coming. I am so excited. Braylon's gonna freak out. When I came downstairs, I saw Braylon hanging out by the table with no guests. He was looking so worried that no one was gonna come and then this happened. You just have to give people some time. I started to notice some friends rolling up to our house. I told you somebody was gonna come. Oh uh, yeah, I'm actually pretty excited. Who, who's coming? I don't know. Oh look, his friends are here. Oh, we'll say hi, we'll say hi. That's it, say hi, all right, hi. Hi guys, oh my gosh, thank you all so much for coming. Are you guys, did you guys bring your swim stuff? Yeah. Oh yay, okay, cool. And the gaming truck's out there? 
The first thing all the boys wanted to do was try out the giant water slide. Before I knew it, all of the guests had arrived, including Braylon's special guest. This is Chris. This Hello. is my, my big cousin. He's my yeah. baby cousin, but he's my big cousin. He came all the way from Ohio with my auntie and baby Hunter. We're about to sneak up on Braylon. I'll go truck. I haven't seen Braylon in a bit. Talk about you all the time. Yeah. Okay, you stay right here. Come here. I have oh, a surprise for you. Banana and Papa are coming too. Turn around. Don't look. Don't look right. Turn around. Uh -oh. You're such a cheater! You keep okay, looking! Okay, okay! I'm trying to see where I'm going. No, 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 we'll watch okay. you. You're okay. You you're fine. Oh, you're fine. Alright, Braylon! Turn around! Amidst all of Braylon's new amazing friends, he is about to be joined by a familiar face that has journeyed all the way across the country to join his celebration. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <man. laughs> I don't care. Wow. Thank you guys. Is that a good birthday gift? Yes. Alright guys, let's have some fun! Let's go. Now the boys are headed to the moment they've all been waiting for, which is the game truck. Holy crap! Before Braylon can get his big surprise present at the end of this video, we all have to sing him happy birthday. Happy birthday! He cannot be into sports and stuff like that. He, can't he was compete. told at the beginning of this year that he wasn't ever allowed to professionally compete in or anything professional sports. Or anything in high school sports or anything. So, yes, we know he loves certain things. And we know he's been bothering me so freaking much. Well, son, you ready? <laughs> Thank you. As Braylon's 14th birthday party comes to an end, his basketball hoop will soon be standing tall as a symbol of resilience and determination for him to never give up. He's surrounded by friends who defy distance and time to be here. Braylon realized that true support shows no bounds. I hope he remembers this day forever and everyone who made it special to him. Thank you so much for watching. Um, hey kid. You know, you can't stay with these people. You have to come home.